What's up, guys? It's Lex, and I'm back with another video. <laughs> Not for real. Yeah, I'm back. And as you can see by the title, we're doing things a little different. You know, we've been doing um, strawberries, but today we're in the kitchen making candy apples. So, first things first, when making candy apples, you gotta clean them. So, what other video would I do first? other than the clean and make the video and that's what we're about to do thank you guys for all the love and support you have shown this far we are at like 260 some subscribers i love it i love it let's keep it going tell a friend and tell a friend to come subscribe this is what i need to be life of lex that's what they need to be um but yeah i don't think there's nothing else to say so other than that let's get into the video Okay, so first thing first, you guys, to clean your candy apples, of course, you're going to need apples. I prefer using Granny Smith apples. You can use the ones in the bag or you can hand pick your own, the big ones. You're going to need a pot to boil some water in. Yes, some water. You're going to need water. Um, you're going to need some big bowls. Um, in this video, you will see me using little bitty bowls because I'm at Trey's house. You know, y'all remember Trey from the other videos. That's my boyfriend. He just moved into his apartment, so he don't have big bowls like I have in my apartment. So I'm using his little bitty cereal bowls. So, but yeah, we're going to improvise. We're going to make work. Bada, bada, boom. So, um, yeah, you need bowls. You're going to fill your bowl, your little bitty bowls with ice cold water. So, yes, you're going to need ice. Ice, baby. <laughs> but for real. Oh, slow. I must fail. But yeah, that's all you need to clean your apples. So without further ado, let me show y'all what to do. <laughs> we weren't in our normal setting like we normally would be, but um, I'm gonna, you know, make it the best I can. So I got my pot of boiling water right here. This is the easiest method you could ever do when it comes to cleaning candy apples. And it's the same day cleaning method. So you can clean it right now and then go dip them when your mix get ready. This is why I love this method so much. And all you need is just water in a bowl. So I'm just gonna put some ice in my bowl here. I had dipped a couple of ice before the video. And I was like, wait, maybe not dip all of them so I can show my YouTube channel how to do some. This is an apple that I have already dipped. Okay, so what you do, you just take your apples and you put them in the water. Just like this. You just throw them in there. And what you're going to do, you're going to let your apple sit in the water for at least 30 seconds. You're going to rotate it around. Make sure all sides of the apple reach the water. So, I uh, changed the view really quick. Just to show you guys that there's nothing in my water besides water. And just the apples. This is all you do to the apples. You rotate them around in the water. For at least 30 seconds putting them in the water just cleans off the wax on the outside of the apple so that you do not have any bubbles inside of your apple well on the outside of your apple you don't want to leave your apple in the water too long because if you do you'll start cooking the inside of the apple and you don't want that to happen so we have clean oh so i have left them in here for at least 30 seconds so once you leave them in there for 30 seconds, then you're gonna transfer them over to your bowl of cold water. Like I said, y'all got bigger bowls than me cause I'm not at my apartment, I'm at Trey's and he just moved in. So I just had to use his little cereal bowls for this. And you're gonna let it sit in there for 30 seconds. Like I said, guys, this is a real simple and easy cleaning method, and I love it. So now, we're just going to drop some more apples in here. Boom. 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 Um, we got some more apples in here already, but they have already, uh, you know, started. So I'm just going to move over. Ooh, I gotta be careful, y'all. I gotta be careful. I'm just gonna move over this bowl so you can see. So you're gonna need a paper towel or a clean white rag. 
These are brand new, have never been used. So you're gonna take your water, not your water, you're gonna take your apple out of the water, get it, and you're gonna clean it. You're gonna wipe it out. And boom, there you have a clean apple that's ready to be dipped in candy apple mix. But you hear this. But you don't hear it right here though. You don't hear it right here. 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 So that means your apple is clean. Now, if you heard that squeaky noise all over your apple, that means it needs to go back in the water and it needs to be re because it is not clean. Okay, got it? Good. Boom. Y'all, that is literally all it is to cleaning these apples. So now, all my apples that are clean are ready to be dipped, which will be in the next video. Booyah. Okay, you guys. So, um, this literally was like the quickest YouTube video that will ever be posted on this channel. Besides the one about the Red River Cheesecake, because it was just a video that I pre-recorded. But, um, yeah, so... Make sure you guys tell a friend to tell a friend to come subscribe. Make sure you guys give this video a thumbs up. Subscribe if you're new here. Turn those post notifications on. Like and comment. Make sure you give this video a thumbs up. Okay, okay, okay. Tell a friend, tell a friend. Share this video with all your friends. Tell them to come check us out and subscribe to the Life of Lex channel. Tomorrow, we will be doing the candy apple video. So stay tuned. It's coming. I love you guys. Bye.